I saw a man that always told me God was leading him and he would follow his feelings of God leading him. But it was always in direct rebellion to everything else in the church and to the word of God, obviously, number one, and to the assembly and to the leading of the Lord. It was all, everybody, there was always 12 guys over here and one guy over here. Why? Right. Led by his feelings. Yeah, a spirit was speaking to him. I don't know which one. It wasn't the Holy Spirit, though, I can tell you that. I said the same thing. Suppose your child says the same thing to you. Son, go clean your room. Well, look, Dad. I prayed about it. God's led me in a different direction. I've got to follow my heart, Dad. So... God is leading me to absolutely disobey everything you're saying and to go my own way because I heard God speak to me. Well, son, I think your hearing's a little messed up. I think I'd like to help you with that. Right? Would that, would that be what you would say? Would you say, hey, well, hey, God spoke to you. I mean, hey. You know how many charismatics have told me the same thing? Hey, God spoke to me. Well, hey, I mean, it's against the word of God, but hey, he spoke to you. So God's just saying, ignore my word and follow, follow this. What are those? Those are devils. You're listening to devils, not God. Stop listening to devils. It's not good. You're not supposed to listen to devils. You're supposed to read the written word of God and follow it. I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. If any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book. And if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life, and out of the holy city, and from the things which are written in this book. He which testifieth these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you.